for years we've all known that when you draw a line or something you can always use the object snaps to get to the end point or the center or whatever okay but um and i typically run with my uh these object snaps turned on these three at the top and then intersection and extension in another video we'll talk about intersection and extension but for now those are the ones that i usually run uh, but sometimes i do need to use things like perpendicular or tangent or nearest okay and in order for me to do that, if I were to draw a line and I want to go from this endpoint, but I want to get to the tangent of the circle, I would use a shift and a right click, and I'd come over here and I'd find tangent in this list, and I would have the tangency done for me. However, I can speed that process up a little if I just use this little trick that I, I learned many, many, many years ago, where I can draw a line and go from the endpoint, and let's just say I want to go to the tangent. Well, tangent is G at the keyboard command G enter well not even an enter just hit G and then I'm in there all these little shortcuts here all, all these little uh, object snap overrides have shortcuts here let me show you to get that where I learned it was many years ago in an old uh, operating system but Windows has since turned it off if you come down here and you do a search for settings okay in in your uh, uh, operating system and you'll be taken to this window settings and you head over here to the ease of access okay and you're going to come down here to the keyboard section and scroll down all the way down till you see uh where is it i usually find it uh allow there it is underline access keys when available let's turn that on real quick okay it's on now i can close this and now when I do a shift and a right click, you're going to see that I have these letters underlined. So E is endpoint, M is midpoint, I is intersection, G is tangent. That's how I knew G was tangent earlier. Okay, Q is quadrant, C is center. After a while, you just memorize these. But those are the shortcut keys that I use. So example, I want to do object snap overrides without any object snaps whatsoever. I'm going to turn off my object snaps. Okay, L, enter, shift, right click, E takes me to the end point. Shift right click C takes me to the center. Shift right click E back to end point. Shift right click M is midpoint. I don't have to hit enter. Okay. And since I can't snap to this end point because I don't have them on, shift right click E and I'm back to the end point. So if you toggle these little underlined uh, letters on, after a while they will become second nature and you will be able to ease these Object snap overrides much faster than having to search through this list. Alrighty, I hope this helps.